Pizza. El carro, y aquí está el carro. The uh, new eight passenger DeLorean is currently running its pre-time travel systems checks. So please stand by. Any sign of trouble? 
No? Well, the old cat, this guy's a real jerk. <laughs> they call the security. Give me a break. There's no way God Mark's gonna stop me now. Excuse me. I gotta finish my repair work. <laughs> Now, please stand by for an important message from the Institute's Chief Inventive Officer, Dr. Emmett Brown. Now that you're here, time travel volunteers, I can give you your pre-flight briefing. There's a lot you'll need to know if you're to successfully cross the space-time continuum. We'll have to hurry, though. The Biff's still on the loose. Anything could happen. Did you get in here? What a chance these bozos. Doc, one of our time travel teams was conducting an experiment back in 1955. He must have stowed away. Hey, I'm not one to pass up a free ride. <laughs> I got all the time I want! <laughs> Unlock these gates! Alan! I'll stop a bye-bye! The passenger, the Lion Time Hero, that's it. I'll just hop in it. Great Scott, what am I thinking? I'm trapped like a rat in my own office. There's no way I can get to the time machine. Hold on a minute. I can get to it, but my time travel volunteers, you and you and you, you're my only hope. The passenger, the Lion, is just beyond that door where you're standing. I can pilot my remote control from here, but I'm going to need you to help me navigate. You've got to catch Biff. The fate of the entire universe rests in your hands. Now try and relax while we go over a few final safety instructions. Here are a few safety tips you should know before taking off. Watch your head as you step into the time travel vehicle. Once in, slide to the furthest seat. Adults, watch your head as the ceiling slopes down in the back. Remain seated. The safety restraint will be activated by one of Doc Brown's assistants. Keep your arms and legs away from the door. Take extra care that cameras and other personal belongings do not interfere with the safety restraint. No photography is permitted during the ride. And please, no smoking, eating, or drinking while inside the time vehicle. We ask that you follow these simple safety tips during your journey across the space-time continuum. Enjoy your flight. I almost forgot. In order to successfully bring Biff back to our time period, it is necessary to accelerate up to 88 miles per hour and bump him. That's right, bump him. The impact of two traveling time vehicles will create a time vortex, sucking both vehicles and time travelers back to their original point of departure. There's no telling where or when Biff may be leading us, so be prepared for anything. Good luck, time travelers. Get ready. 
ready. Don't worry about a thing. You're in good hands. Yeah. I still haven't worked all the bugs out of this thing. But no matter if we're on a mission of universal proportions. Doc, Biff has passed through the space-time continuum, and we've got no way of knowing where he is. You mean, when he is? We do have a way of us to track Biff to his precise location at the precise moment in whatever time period he may have traveled to. Doc, all pre-launch system checks are complete. That's our cue. Hang on to your hats. Thank <laughs> you. 
Success! Call forth time travelers and remember the future is what you make it. Please lift lap bar and exit. Hurry up, get out! Before you meet yourself coming in! Oh, 